everybody. All right, so we're going to get down to it. Um, someone on Discord was having trouble figuring out the control center when it comes to this area right here. Control center is actually going to be for your lights. And I'm sorry, I'm trying to go to my response here, who I was helping earlier. Okay, so mind max on Discord. What we're gonna do is we're gonna start with the on and off function. This is the welcome, this is like a brand new slate. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna drag over the on and off button. In this case, I have my lights set up already. This is what the control center does. So this is my right light. This will be my left light. This will be my ring light. And if I wanted to turn them all on, I could technically just create an all button. Um, you can rename these. And uh, what did I do? That's left, that's right. So I wanna switch them so that way I know which one's what. And then here is my ring light. Now, if you're like me and you like to do a folder, I usually leave the folder there and I just kind of move it over by one. All right, so if I were to tap these buttons directly on my, my stream deck right now, I can see that the lights are turned on. Now, if I wanted to turn them all off again at once, I can. So if I wanted to just keep my left one off, I could do that. If I wanted to turn my right one off, I could do that. This one is controlling my ring light. The reason why I do it in this order is for me, I'm, I'm able to know this, but I, I have it set up on a different um, area section and I'll show you all that. All right, so brightness. This is going to set the brightness for whatever light. So I'm gonna do this for the left light. So I'm gonna actually jump down to left. You can change, this is basically going to add the brightness. If I remember it, how did I do it? Okay, yeah, so this is going to be for my left. This is the brightness for my right. This will be the brightness for my, um... okay, so you see these right here? These, when you click on them, you can change the icons, but that's not what I was trying to do. Uh... Oh, here we go. So you can change these on the scale here if you wanted to and it increases by 50% as you select the button. I personally don't wanna do that, but you can. Um, you can adjust the brightness, right? So you can increase it or you can decrease it. This is actually the one I have set up. I don't really care to do that right there, but uh, if you want to adjust your brightness, and the reason why I'm doing it in the layers is because I can go here and change it to my left light change it to my right, change it to my ring light. Same thing, um, I think that it gives you an option. I don't actually have the uh, RGB strip that some people have. If not, I would show you that too. But if I wanted to increase the brightness by five, because I, I prefer to do it in five increments, everybody's different on how they wanna do that, but I prefer five. So this is going to be to increase it. Now, if I want to decrease it, I'm gonna do the brightness again except this time I'm gonna put minus five. So this is how I know this will increase and then this will get darker. That's why it's telling you the light and dark icon is based on the settings that you choose for it. So I'm gonna select adjust brightness again. This time it's gonna be my right. Oh wait, this was supposed to be left. This is gonna be my right. And I want to decrease it by five. It's the same thing here. And then I'm gonna adjust my brightness again, but for my ring light. And I'm gonna set that up to minus five. So this will make it brighter and this will make it darker. Now, I'm not gonna mess with my light settings because I already have mine where I want them to be. And let's see here. So temperature, temperature is going to do the same thing. You can set it to be however you want to be, just like if you wanted to set your brightness and just have it at that. Um, and it tells you whatever your setting is going to be. I don't wanna do that, but if you want to adjust your temperature, and this is gonna be the same concept. 
So what I'm going to do is drag two of these here because this is how I usually set it up when I'm doing my lights. So that way I just have to push the buttons on my stream deck and it controls my lights. So this is my left light and I want it to increase by, where is it? It's only 10 is the lowest. Fine. That's going to make it cool by 10 and this will increase it to warm. Maybe I should, yeah, I like that dark and then light. Or actually, you know what? No, let's switch it around warm and cool. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm having way too much fun, even though I'm not gonna use this template because I already have mine set up and I'll show you what mine looks like here in a minute. But uh, let's do it this way. So this is gonna be right to increase the warmth by 10 and decrease it by 10. So wait, did I say right? I meant left. Huh. Don't know my right from my left today. Okay, here we go. So these are the right ones. So we're gonna decrease this one by 10. Wait, that's the light. We need to do it this way. So this is already set at 10. It's the lowest. Um, you can change it to whatever you prefer if you, if you want. But we're gonna go ahead and decrease it by 10. So that's usually just setting up your lights. So if I wanted to turn it on, I'll, I'll give you a preview. If I wanted to increase it, it would increase my light. You cannot see that, but I can. Um, if I wanted to make it warmer, I can select that. If I wanted to make it cooler, I would select the cooling button. That's pretty much the control center. Um, I try to make it easy. I have not played with this, but from what I understand, you can set it up with RGB to set your colors. You know, if you have the Elgato light or whatever, um, RGB light. The reason why it's in red and, and I'll give you an example. Most people like to set up certain things with RGB a certain way. Um, you could essentially come here, drag it to red, switch the button, and it'll turn it red. Because I don't have this accessory, this is moot for me. But that's pretty much how you would set it up if you had the color one. Um, I wish I had uh, the color one hooked up here so I could show you, but I don't. I'm sure that there's plenty of videos on the internet that cover it. But I really wanted to just show you Control Center. That's exactly what this is. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. It was a very short video, and I hope this helped you out. Uh, mine, mine Max on Discord. Have a wonderful evening, everybody. And if you like what you saw, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.